Hey guys, welcome to another Awakening Energy Transmission Kundalini Activation Energy that can be used for Kundalini Awakenings if that's what you wish to do. Just connect to the energy. It's Kundalini Activation Energy. We discussed yesterday the difference between Kundalini Activation and Kundalini Awakening. Just connect. And for those of you who've been connecting with me, you might feel today this energy is different because I'm not quite sure how to explain it sort of released something yesterday as we all are going through our stages, we're all at different stages and we all have to go through different levels, etc. And I have sort of, something was released, something big was released and I can feel my energy has changed. Can you notice the difference? If you can, put a comment about how it feels different. I could tell you what I feel that is different. It would be so much more awesome if you guys can tell me what you feel is different from this energy. Does it feel more? Does it feel less? Does it feel heavier or lighter? As I said, the Kundalini activation, there's not just one level, there's many levels. And raise the energy and lower the energy when we get control of it. Some people are very mistaken that they think only gurus can do this. That would be a big misunderstanding, a big mistake. Powers like this have been around in all cultures for millions of years. That's why we have energy healers from all different cultures and shamans around the world. Got the chi masters, yogic masters. We also have energy healers in Africa and Australia, South America, North America. And of course, the European energy healers. There have been many cultures that have done many things. We've all heard of Druids. What were they? Just go with it. So for me, what did this feel like when it changed? Well, as they say, if you look deep into sort of the many different Hindu religions, they treat gods as gates rather than human beings, as others do with their humanoid or human figures. That's why they have many hands and different colors. For me, it was though as though one of these figures was just released out of me. I felt a huge change in me and I felt much lighter. And then and I tried to connect with my energy just to see what happened. 
there's a difference. I'm like, I've got to go share this with everybody. And that's me here now. Very strange experience. I said, please let me know what you feel. I feel it's perhaps more subtle, yet with more power. Perhaps you feel something different. I'm giving you possible ideas. What do you feel? Thank you guys so much. Lots of positive comments have been coming in on the channel. Thank you guys. It really helps when I can read positive comments, especially a couple of comments of people suffering pain and things like that. From certain unfortunate diseases and things like that. Getting comments coming in after these videos, they feeling so much better. Thank you guys. Because receiving positive comments and positive feedback makes it so much easier just to keep going, to produce more content for you and push my own limits to be able to bring you more. So thank you. Yeah, now, empty mind, non-dual mind, connecting to this pranic Shakti energy. Yeah, there's definitely some Shiva in there today. So you can notice the different levels that I'm sending. differentiate between them. You have to be quite sensitive to notice the subtleties. Stay with me. Keep going. same wonderful sensations, depending on where you are today, with your energy. Of course, that does. It changes just if your mind is running due to stress. It will indeed sort of slightly block you from connecting and that's why we need to empty our minds and be empty and just receive. Be here and now. Mm. 
Namaste.